Hey everybody, it's Shannon. I wanted to hop on here and show you guys how to do a Zoom meeting, how to do a Zoom launch party, how to do a Zoom uh, meet Monate, how to do Zoom trainings, but really I'm going to focus on how to do a Zoom launch party or meet Monate right now. So I've, I've logged in to Zoom. I started a meeting and when I went to, I'm sorry, when I went to Zoom, I'm going to show you guys what I did. So hold on one second. Um, so when you want to share your screen, you're going to get this little green button right here on this taskbar that says share screen. And then you can go to whatever window you have open up in your browser that you want to focus on. So whatever you can see is what people can see that are watching. So what I did was, um, first of all, when I went to the Zoom website, I'm going to show you guys what that looks like. So let's see, I went to Zoom. And right here, this is my Zoom account. And then over here, there's host a meeting. Well, you can, add, it'll ask you, do you want to have video on or off? That means, do you want people to be able to see you on video? Do you want the, to be able to see the participants? For a Zoom launch party, you may just want to show the PowerPoint. So in that case, you would, you would click on video off. Uh, if you are doing training and you want everybody to be able to see as well as hear each other, then you would do video on. So I, um, for the purpose of this video right here that I'm recording, I clicked on video off because I just want to be able to show you guys my screen. So it says you're in another meeting already. Do you want to leave and join? Well, no, I don't because then that would cut the one off right now. So, but um, then it will start your it'll give you you know window will open up and you will uh, be prompted to be able to start your meeting so what i did was i turned it off i made sure that i didn't want people's faces showing up as they started getting on once they clicked on the link so let's say you've created the zoom link you know mary's going to have a launch party next wednesday night at seven o'clock um, you've gone in and told uh, Zoom how to, that you want to, you have a meeting at seven o'clock uh, and you put in the time. As soon as you do that, it spits out to you the uh, link to that meeting and the phone number. So let me show that again. So let's say host a meeting and um, I don't even know if it's going to let me do this actually while I am on a meeting already, but um, once that you do that, you can go over, you can go to host a meeting and it'll ask you what time and date and they'll give you the link to that meeting and a phone number and all that kind of stuff. Well, then once you're in Zoom, you can come over here to my meetings and whatever you have scheduled. I don't have any upcoming right now. I do need to schedule a launch party for next Wednesday though, but it, it, they'll, be, they'll be here with a link and everything to them. Uh, you can copy and paste that link into whoever you want to invite to the meeting. So, um, for the purpose of showing you how to do a launch party, you would start your meeting. If you don't want to be able to see everybody's faces and you know, everybody see each other, just turn the video off and go ahead and schedule your meeting. And then when it's time to start, you'll start, you'll come in here, your meeting will be listed under my meetings and you'll click on the link and it'll ask you if you want to start the meeting. So yes. So then um, what I do is I have my PowerPoint pulled up already in the window, in a window uh, or on my uh, computer, and, and there it is. So as I'm talking, everybody can hear me talking, but nobody can see me because I've got video off. Um, I'm going to go through the PowerPoint down here. You can see the arrow buttons and everything. And I'm going to read from that verbiage script that's also in our group. Uh, I've already printed that out. And I'm going to read through that as I am clicking on the, um, sorry, the slides for the, for the PowerPoint. So we're going through the slides. You can take this one out. You can put your own photo there, whatever you want to do. Um, 
we're going to go through the slides. So this is what everybody's going to be seeing who has clicked on the link to join the Zoom meeting. They're going to see this and they're going to hear me talking, but they're not going to see my face. So I'm going to be reading from that script as it'll say slide one, and then there's verbiage to read while you're on slide one. Okay, and it'll say the slide one says who is Monet at the top. And then as I go through, I'm going to click through again. Why Monate on that verbiage script? It says slide two. Why Monate? I'm going to be reading, and it's different verbiage than what they're seeing on the screen. Now I could just, you know, read from some of the stuff that's on here if I didn't want to follow that script, but the script is much more in depth. Uh, and you never want to just read straight from what's on the PowerPoint. You want to kind of throw in other other information besides what's on there because that's just kind of a brief description you want to get a, a little bit more um, you know information than just one on the slide uh, but certainly if you didn't have the slip the script handy or whatever you could just basically make talk about these points that are on the slide and then so i'm going through each slide i'm reading from each little paragraph about each slide and we're going through and we're talking about the business and we're talking about the products and everything and we do the presentation we get to the end, and of course, we talk about that awesome glam pack and what MMPs can earn in August or October. And we get to the end, and the choice is yours. And then you you conclude your meeting at that point. It's brief. It's awesome. Um, as soon as you get through, uh, when you come back, let me let me come back here. So. Um, go back to my meeting when you go back to your zoom and you click you tell everybody goodbye thank them for attending you know it's up to them at that point please get with your market partner get with Susie or Mary or whoever and, and let them know you know do you want to be a customer or market partner or um, do you know somebody who might be interested in either the products or the business opportunity and then you will um, end your meeting now Zoom automatically starts converting that as soon as you end your meeting, uh, that recording, because you recorded it. And it will save to a file on your computer. And at that time, once that's completed, you can upload that to your YouTube channel. And it's very easy to do. So, and there you go. You have a, you have a recorded Zoom launch or Zoom Meet Monate, and uh, you're ready to go. That's something you could share, upload, and everything. It's so brilliant and so easy so I just wanted to show you guys um, what what it's like and how you do it and that's pretty much the gist of it so if you have any questions just reach out and I would be happy to um, answer any questions that you have about it but hopefully this will give you some confidence to go in and play around with zoom you can have a free account it's also a free app you can have uh, meetings up to 30 minutes long for free up to 100 participants per meeting um, I did upgrade to $15 a month because I want to be able to do trainings that, that I know will last longer than 30 minutes. So I don't want to go, I don't want to automatically be cut off at 30 minutes. So I did upgrade to the one that's $15 a month. And that one you can also have up to 100 participants on, but you can have unlimited meeting times. So there's no uh, cap on how long your meeting can last. And um, I think, let me see if there's anything else that I want to share show you um i think that's it so down here i'll end up clicking in meeting because i've recorded this zoom is automatically going to start compressing it and saving it into a file uh, on my computer and once it's done that i can upload that file into youtube and share the link with you guys so have any questions reach out and i'll talk to you soon bye